Hey, uh, let's, let's, let's just check. Whoops, a daisy. There we go. Whoops. I think I just fixed something there. I'm just going to fix something else as well. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Hey, how are you doing? Hope you're all well and thank you very much for joining. Just going to wait for a couple more just to jump on now and then I'll, um, there we are. There we go, there we go. Um, hi Heather, hi everybody that's joining. Um, so tonight we're not going to do any live broadcasts of the show. Um, we're going to do, oh, I just found some crap on the floor. We're going to do that tomorrow, um, tomorrow. And so tonight we're not going to put anything out there tonight because it's a, you know what, it's Easter Saturday and um, there's lots of cool things that you should be doing with your family instead of watching Ghost Dimension Live on um, on here. So make sure you check it out and spend some time with your family, even though you're in isolation and with them anyway. So, um, but we're not gonna be doing that tonight. Uh, if um, anybody wants to jump on the page and go live, just drop us a message and you know what, you can. We'll let you go live, we'll just give you access and off you go. But um, we're not going to put anything out ourselves tonight, so you can definitely, if you want to, get in touch and come on here and talk anything paranormal tonight, feel free to get in touch and speak to us and do it. Um, Heather, Paul's there. Hi, Tricia. Uh, Craig, hi. We had fantastic viewership last night for um, the episode that we broadcast of Ghost Dimension at the Haunted Mansion. It was fantastic. The Haunted Mansion, yes. Um, the Haunted Mansion that we broadcast last night was fantastic and it, it was good to see so many people uh, jumping on and get involved so thank you so so much and uh, we popped a link on uh, shortly afterwards for PayPal and a few people got involved in that as well and sent us like a, a little tip which is nice and it just keeps us going and keeps us surviving so thank you so much for the people that did that um, it's really appreciative we haven't got like a uh, uh, an automatic facility on here to send tips. So we just posted a link to our PayPal, which I'll just post there and people tipped us. Thank you so, so much. Um, grab that idea off Flecky Bennett and uh, you know what, it helps out really, really good. So hi, Emma. Hi, Trisha. Um, oh, from Glasgow, smashing. Uh, happy Easter to you all. And did you see my TV that I sent you? I probably haven't, but if you sent it to my uh, inbox, I would have probably missed it. Because um, no, I don't always sit on the Facebook Messenger system. So uh, if you did, I'm very sorry, I've not seen it yet, but I'll look for it and have a look later. You know what I did yesterday? Um, I'll tell you what I did. Hi, Stephen. What I did yesterday, I went online, and I don't know if um, anybody has used this application on your phone called Wix, not Wix, Wish. And um, you can buy so much crap on there, and it is so addictive um, to sit on there and buy crap. Um, but I bought some face masks ready for, because I think once this virus thing is semi in its ending stages and they let us out, I don't think the virus will be finished. So I wanted to make sure that we're all protected. So I bought some masks all the way from, you guessed it, China. So they're coming from China. And uh, hopefully when they arrive, we'll be able to uh, we'll be able to go out after we've, um, if we're allowed out, obviously. Um, hi, Emma, how's your bank holiday going? It's going okay. Um, decided to take the bank holiday off and stay inside bit like isolation, if you know what I mean. Didn't fancy going out to the beach or anything. Not that I'm not allowed to. Um, Lee Bowen, hi from sunny. Oh, it is sunny today, isn't it? It's gorgeous outside. It's beautiful weather. Beautiful weather. Uh, sunny Derbyshire from Angie and Lee. Well, hi, Angie and Lee. Um, get yourselves out in the garden. I've been sat in the house most of the day with the kids because the kids wanted to have a go of um, this game on the... PlayStation called Goat Simulator, and uh, it's quite addictive. If you've not played it, try it and try it out. It's really, really good fun. 
and uh, choose away some hours but we will be going out into the garden very very soon um, otherwise we'll miss the uh, the sunshine um hey scott hello from oklahoma I like oklahoma you know who's in oklahoma the tiger king and that carol baskin uh, i don't get my mask till may probably when i get mine to be honest as well so but you know what i probably won't be allowed out in may anyway so it don't matter yet does it um one thing i did notice on this uh i don't know if uh, this is for people in the uk that are watching but seeing my side bits getting bushing out need a haircut um the uh every i was watching these prime minister thing update stuff yesterday and every time they, they don't have an answer for anything um so will somebody will say well when are we going to be allowed out you know are you allowed to tell us and they'll go we are guided by the science which is weird you know why did the can't why can't our government just come out and answer a question? If it was Donald Trump, he'd just go, "Well, I've heard about letting you out and like Mary or Joan Bars, guided by the science." That's the exit answer for everything. Everything that you don't want to answer if you're a politician in the UK, we're guided by the science. Hey, and then and I don't know. I'm going to rant on this just one thing now. And noticed also that they mentioned, um, uh, like, because uh, Boris Johnson is in uh, hospital coming out now, um, but they said, hey, you know, have you got powers to do stuff? Well, you know, because everybody wants to stop these idiots going to the beach. You know, that's why we're asking, yeah? And instead of going, no, we haven't. They, they don't like to answer that because they're not in control. They just go, well, everybody's doing a fantastic job and we've been allowed to chair meetings and stuff like that, you know, and so it's all fantastic. And it just, you know, to yesterday, it just peed me off because um, it's like every time I, you know, I purposely tune in at five o'clock every day to watch this daily update and uh, also watch these people just giving crap. So, you know, I mean, it's weird, man. It's weird. Um, let's just have a quick look on some of the comments there. Do, 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 do. Alabama here. Wow. Nice. Aha, uh -huh, I know what you mean. Thinking of going to Allegate and back today. We'll see. Yep, let's see if you can get out and not get arrested by. I've seen some of the Manchester police have been a bit heavy handed at the minute. Um, I saw something just before. Uh, what was it? I saw. Oh, they arrested um, uh, um, a black guy um, and threatened to pepper spray him because he was dropping off. Um, uh, groceries to his uh, relatives you know and then told the the neighbors who were on looking or whatever if they didn't back off they'd get sprayed too you know what stupidity you know i understand the social distance and i understand not going out but boy oh boy you know what i mean have some common sense you know everybody's now being treated with the same brush <coughs> Hi, I try. Hi, I try and send it. Can I play that game? It's really good. Oh, good. Wish is a drug. It is a drug. Honestly, I'm telling you, proper is a drug. Um, Lee, hi. Are there any apps do you guys use on your phones when on investigating on um, investigations? No, we've used um, things in the past, and uh, we didn't find it that much useful. Like if it's like an Oculus Star device on a mobile phone, then it's a pre-programmed library phone. Now think about it. This is a mobile phone. It's designed to surf the internet, receive calls and do some other things. It wasn't designed as a ghost hunting gadget. And so to utilize the parts inside of this as a ghost hunting gadget would, it, it would only work to a certain limit purely because they're not designed for that purpose. And so I don't think it's a great idea to rely on mobile phone apps um, as, a, as a tool, fantastic tool for EVP. Can be okay for EMF because they have like, if you try it, they've got this EMF thing in them. But as of for most of the other things, where there's a lot of word prediction, things that come out on these devices, I, I don't think they're that good purely because it's a mobile phone. Jane, hi from Essex. Hi, Jane. Absolutely love your program. Watch it every day. Well, thank you so much. We really do appreciate this support. 
of everybody that watches the shows, especially when you watch it every day. It's fantastic. Here's Bex. What are you looking for? What type of charger? The dots on the table, tiny table. She's looking for a charger. She wants to watch live. Um, Craig, the police have parts up in Oaken <coughs> Halton Arrows, stopping us leaving Flint. You can't go out of the area without a good reason, even if you want to go out, if you want to go to the big ass stuff in Queens very well. <laughs> crazy, proper crazy. And um, Jane saying that I do make you laugh when I scream. Thank you so much. You know, um, tomorrow night we will be broadcasting another episode of Ghost Dimension. Mm -hmm. Awesome on scene. We'll make our decision on that tomorrow. Um, and it'll be quite good. Uh, I was thinking about getting an episode out from series four and posting it on here and on YouTube. So this is Facebook and on YouTube because we, we do everything on all multiple social media platforms. And uh, if you've not already been over uh, to YouTube or to Facebook, um, please pop over and subscribe and give us a like um, and set reminders for when we do go live so you don't miss out. Um, Jane's on again there. Uh, my partner has just got into the program. We love you all. Thank you so much. Uh, a big hello to your partner as well. Uh, Ian O'Leary is is uh, ghosting it with a smiley face and a thumbs up. Nice to see you, Ian. So I hope you're all keeping very, very safe in this crazy, crazy world that we are in at the minute. Um, oh, hi, Martin. Hi, Sean. Um, and keeping safe because out there it's a complete minefield at the minute. You know what? I went to, uh, I'll tell you this one more thing as well. I went to, there's um, a shop not far from us called um, Barney's Rubbles and it sells all sorts of crap. Um, but it's good crap. And it's like uh, washing tablets. Everything that you don't need that you'll buy anyway is in this shop. Plus crisps and drinks that are going out of date and stuff like that. And it's a good shop of crap to go to if you like to shop at crap shops and buy stuff but i've been trying to go there all week and um, because of this new social distancing uh routine um there's been a queue of like a hundred people in this one small shop every day i've just been like no no um and it's just been a proper proper nightmare so i just want to go out they were selling flowers today. I couldn't get them. So gutted, gutted. Never mind, hey, never mind. So yeah, as whoever that is on Ghost Dimension, um, like, oh, it's probably back, up. Hi, guys. Like and share for us if you can, please. Yes, like and share. And don't forget to subscribe. New one. Man's the word. Boom. Um, yeah, so, to, so today, purely because it's um, Easter. Excuse me. Can't cut that out, can I? Because not that we're alive. And purely because it's Easter, um, we're not going to show you anything tonight. Not unless Paul wants to go live or Jane wants to go live. But we're not going to show you anything. We're going to save it till tomorrow. I'm going to bring you something really, really good tomorrow from season four. And it will be epic. And um, I've, I've got an idea of which one I want to put on. I'll just check it with Bex in a bit because... She might go, no, you can't put that on. You have to put this one. So I'll check that first with her. Martin says, hi, Sean. Hi, how are you doing? <clears throat> I'm good. Uh, I hope you are too, mate. Oh, bugger. Drop me a drink. But this is what I got from the shop of crap. Kingsley Orange. Look at that. Interesting. Uh, bought that like a week ago, and it's probably... When, when did I buy it? A week ago? I don't know, Sin Day. Never mind, let's have a nosy at comments. Lee Bowen, great it's a place to try an investigation if you can get permission, is Higher Cliff Farm in Mellor. Very haunted and a poltergeist in the building. Well, that'd be really, really good. I'd like to uh, check that out and see if, uh, what, if there is um, activity there when we pop over. Absolutely. Thank you so much for suggesting that, Lee. Um, Craig, Lawrence Bailey, oh, I speaking to Paul. Sorry, mate. Now, Jane, you are such a fantastic team. Thank you so much, Jane. You know, that's really kind of you. 
Um, do, 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 do. Laughing my ass off, I did good. Okay, cool. Well, I can just see many conversations happening on the uh, on the live feed there, and uh, I was just checking them out and reading them just to see what they were. So, but yeah, don't forget though. You, what we'll do tonight, yeah, is because we're not putting on a brand new episode. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put a watch party on. So we're going to put on all the stuff that we've seen so far. The watch party. How about that? Hmm? So if you've got nothing else better to do, and you really want to watch Ghost Dimension, because I know everybody does, I'm going to put a watch party on for you. Proper good. I did good. You did good, yes. Don't know what you're referring to, but you did good. And um, is that still a conversation? Get it. I don't know what's happening there. Just, hey, look at that. Look how long that is. Oh, it's that side. And the hair's really long. Watch. It's that high. Look at that. I'm thinking if it, because I can't get a haircut, and I'm not going to let Bex do my hair because she wants to shave my hair and make me look like the Lion King. Um, not the Lion King, the Tiger King. Um, I'm going to um, going to grow it dead long and put a ponytail right at the back. Would you guys ever consider coming down to Suffolk? Uh, once I think comes down. No, bugger off. Not going there. No. Um, yeah, of course we will. Yeah, absolutely. We we'll, we we'll consider going everywhere. So yeah, and we definitely would consider going there. Um, I think, you know, next the next time we film an episode, we'll probably put masks on as well, you know, just in case there's any COVID-19 knocking about and stuff like that. So we'll just keep ourselves safe. Um, do, do. Hi, Karen Griswold. Hi, hello, Sean. How are you? Good, good. Um, and Julie. Jules. Why are you calling you Julie? I don't know. Quite a few good places out this way. Oh, good. Nice one. We'll have to check it out. That's Suffolk. So we'll, we'll, we'll have a look at that and have a nosy and see uh, if there's anywhere for us to go. Um, uh, oh, if Bex is watching, what I'll do in a bit, love, I'll go to the shop and I'll get some beers and some wine, yeah? For tonight, chill. Does Bex ever do the daily update? Think you should let Bex shave your hair in live? Not happening. Not happening, mate. Yeah, not happening. No, she does. Um, but at the minute, we're in like chill down mode. And, um, you know what women are like? They like to make themselves look good. So she doesn't want to put any makeup on yet. And why should she? Because we're not going out anywhere. So she's just left me to ramble on to everybody and try and keep us all entertained throughout this crazy, crazy lockdown. Um, which hopefully we're, we're pulling off. Um, and hopefully we're keeping it good. Um, do, do, do be safe, everyone says Martin. Yes, what is it again? Stay inside, take the NHS, save lives. Is that right? Something like that. Yes, but uh, Kaz Holmes, hi, Jane Wood, hi, Paul. Be safe, everyone. I was reading them backwards there. <coughs> so, yeah, tonight, let's we'll put a watch party on. Probably put it on about six o'clock, yeah, something like that. And we'll just let it run. Some cool stuff on it, we'll let it run. Um, hey, and see what happens. Uh, anybody watching um, Money Heist at all? Anybody watching that? East Pontefract should go. East Drive Pontefract should go. Not sure. We've been, mate. Kevin, is it Kevin? Kevin Heath. We've been. We did 30 East Drive, mate. Did you miss that one? It's on um, series three, I think. Possibly. So yeah, we've definitely done that one. So uh, definitely, definitely. We have been there, mate. We have been there. Does anybody want to join me live on here quickly before I shoot? Anybody at all want to join me live? Let me send you a quick invite code. Boom. There we go. You're going to paste it into there. Ding. There we are. Oh, has that gone in? Has it gone in? That's the code right there. Join me live. Right there. End of series one, wasn't it? Not too sure, mate. Not too sure. It could have been. But um, it was a good in, uh, investigation. Yes. 
must win an end of series one. That's what Kevin said anyway. Um, Jane Wood, when I get home from work, your program is all I watch. Wow, thank you. And when I get up, love it. Thank you so much. Hi, Paul, says Karen Griswold. It's a cool name, that, isn't it? Griswold. Um, and Jules got a smiley face. And uh, check us out on YouTube, Amazon Prime, Pluto TV, and My Five, and some of our stuff if you're abroad, and new stuff coming very, very soon to the United States of America. Hi, Karen Griswold. Keep you up. Have you keep well? That's Paul. 30 East Drive was very, very scary. It was a spooky, spooky episode. And uh, what can I say? The the activity in that location was some of the most active that we've ever encountered on an investigation, especially with the door opening uh, in, inside that room. And uh, it just went completely nuts. And I can hear kids coming. I can hear crazy kids coming. So it's not in your mind. They're actually here, behind me somewhere. Jane, what top paranormal investigators? Thank you so much. Hey, baby. Should I go for it? Get some Look, chocolate. getting chocolates. Yes. You hear that? Coming in and out. Just make a noise, you see. Oh, yeah. Not brushing your hair. Not brushing your teeth out. You brush your teeth today? Yeah. Good. I have. You brush your teeth, yeah? I did after I watched Tiger King. After you watched what? Tiger King? We're doing all part here in the USA to flatten the curve. Good, nice one, Karen. That's exactly. Uh, what we should be doing. Uh, very good active uh, location in each drive. It was. It was. It was. You see that crisp there, babe? On the floor? Yeah. And that chocolate? Right. Pick it up. No, I right. don't want it on the floor because if you leave it on the floor, it gets walked into this carpet. Pick those two pieces, three pieces up, good. Excellent. Um, thanks, babe. Just, just be careful. Happy Easter, Jane. Hello, gorgeous. Oh, look, yeah. Crazy. Oh, crazy. Girls, yeah. making so much noise. Yeah. If you've got kids and you're at home, nutters. Nutters, honestly. Nutters, there's one lot, see. Is anybody joining? No, nobody's here, look. Nobody's here at all. Are right, you made enough noise now, yeah? Climb yeah. around like monkeys? Ship off. Yeah. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Yeah. Happy well, like, Easter, everybody. Well, my favourite One episode is the Transport Museum. Oh, yes. Yeah. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Oh, me, the bubba. Am I cramping your style? I'm cramping the style, apparently. Am I cramping your style? Yeah. Yeah, 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 you come in your style. Come in your style to the world, look, to the world, world, world. It's me exercise. Doing the, uh, the, instead of going to the gym, this is the new routine. You see? There you go. Right. Brill, listen, I'm going to, um, this a happy Easter, girls, people are saying, yeah? Happy Easter, everybody. Happy Easter, everybody. Happy Easter, everybody. Give me some chocolate. Yes, they shouldn't be in here eating chocolate, should they, monkeys? Oh, she, oh, don't spill that on the couch. Wait, wait, hey, hey. No, no, listen, no, listen to me now. Very carefully. It's out for someone now. Your hands have been all over that. And the hands, I don't know if you've washed them. You, are, you could have COVID on. No, I didn't. Take it for someone because that's now they're going in the bed. That's what I'm looking at. Happy Easter. Bless him. And we've got. So guys, listen, thank you so much for tuning in. Tonight we'll put a watch party on, and then tomorrow we will have more ghost emotion. Yeah? Sounds good to me. Sounds good to you. Hmm? Good, good, good. So listen, thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to all of our uh, social media platforms, which is YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, um, and wherever else we are. Subscribe, like, and share. What time is it there? What time is it here? It's 
20 to 4. And you're in NZ, New Zealand. Lovely. Thank you for the live updates and God bless you. Thank you, everybody. Peace out. Stay safe. Protect your NHS or protect your American um, whatevers, uh, doctors and nurses who are around the world. Enjoy. Stay safe. And we'll speak to you very soon.